Alright, hello, my hello say four. Welcome back to the channel. I'm your host, The Humble. Hope you guys are safe, with love, care for, healthy, blessed, and love some more. Yes, sir, bless sir, never stress sir. Let's go. Alright, today we got another one. Um, this is from the one and only Oliver Anthony. Yes, sir. And the song that he's performing, uh, some of you guys probably already or don't even know about it um i guess it's getting traction and i haven't even listened to it so but we're gonna check it out and then uh we'll put some input uh one thing i did know about you know he's an overnight sensation on top of that uh because of the song he made and probably some of you guys already seen it on my channel and that is rich man north of rich man so rich man north of rich man so I believe it's about uh, the corruption that's going on in the government and all the stuff that's, uh, you know, that's been uh, going on. And not only that affect the, uh, the political world, but as, as well as the community, as in, you know, us, the community in the U.S. So, but uh, let's get to listen to this, uh, this other jam. He just came out and... Uh, and see what he has to offer. So, and the song we're looking at today is called "I Want I Want to Go Home." So, and wow, two million, and it came out one day ago, and it's number two on trending. Wow, this guy is just just cruising right now. So, uh, we're gonna play it right now and uh, see what he got. So. Definitely seem like you got the sauce. <laughs> so without further ado, uh, let me get this up and uh, let's get this show on the road. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You already know. All right. Oliver Anthony, I want to go home. Let's go. Well, if it won't for my whole dogs and the good Lord. They'd have me strung up in the psych ward Cause every day living in this new world Is one too many days to me Son, we're on the brink of the next world war And I don't think nobody's praying no more And I ain't saying I know it for sure I'm just down on my knees Begging the Lord and take me home. I want to go. Wow. Uh, man, we starting off strong. Starting off strong, man. Oh, home. I don't know which road to go. It's been so long. I just know I didn't used to wake up feeling this way. Cussing myself every damn day There's always some kind of bill to pay People just doing what the rich man say I want to go home Wow <laughs> I think, uh, you know I already said it in my previous uh, video Go check it out on uh, you know, his song on Rich Man, North of Richmond. You know, it's just the environment we're in today. Uh, the struggles of, you know, high inflation, barely able to make a living, or what's going on. But at the same time, you know, like the amount of pressure that you're getting, just trying to do what is right, right? So, and sometimes you know I'm not trying to get religion here sometimes you know people go through some hard times and the only thing you know when you can't find that you know outlet or and your back is against the wall you kind of feel like you know just this is the end you know just no how you say it, there's no light at the end of the tunnel you just you know it's time you know just you just want to throw it all all in a bucket and call it a day so, and and 
it's hard to make it a decision because there's so much that's going on and people sometimes you know the only answer and if there's no support and no you know and nobody to to give you that hand you know to to keep going some days man are just more gloomier and and hard to see through the rain through the weather so but man <laughs> right off the bat man Oliver with the hits man Grandson sails to a man out of town And two weeks later, the trees go down Only got concrete growing around And I wanna go home I wanna go home I don't know which road to go It's been so long just know I didn't used to wake up feeling this way Cussing myself every damn day People have really gone and lost their way They all just do what the TV say I wanna go home mm. Man, not a strong point You know, with uh, social media <laughs> And with the TV you know, you know, when I was growing up, I didn't really think much about, you know, the effect of news, uh, the effect of what's been shown on TV that can actually be, de you know, detrimental to not only to our mind, but also, you know, our spiritual side as well. Because, you know, what you see, you tend to play it out, you know, but those are my opinion. So take it with a grain of salt. But. <laughs> uh, it's just uh, you know nowadays you just gotta tread a little bit carefully and you gotta start making decisions you know you know don't get what it's you know I feel like he's trying to say that you know don't get easily be influenced just because you know it's on TV and it's on the internet you know so that's why I'm saying I'm talking to you guys right now you know opinions that has been shared on the internet at the end of the day, make sure you think for yourself, and and remember, you know, it's it's not just one side of the story. There's always many sides to the story. So just just tread carefully and make sure you, you know, think cri critically. So hopefully, you, you know, hopefully you guys get what I'm trying to get to. But man. If it weren't for my whole dogs and the good Lord, they'd have me strung up in the psych ward. For what shall it profit a man if he shall gain the whole world and lose his soul and loses lose his own soul? Script from the Bible. I don't know which one it is, but it talks about you know. I think it. I believe, but I could be wrong because most of the time I am wrong. Um, it's talking about you know. Going after money, right? Uh, if the money becomes the object, then that's where you start losing, right? Because if the money is your whole world, then you're pretty much you're selling your your soul at the, you know, for in exchange for that. So, but then again, I don't know much. I'm just you know thinking off of my head, but. Uh, amazing man, amazing song. Always, you know, 
if it wasn't for his dog. What does he say? If it wasn't for his dog. In the psych ward. If it weren't for my whole dogs and the good Lord, mm. they'd have me strung up in the psych ward. And there you go. It, see, it, it goes back to where I was talking about. Um, whatever you're going through in life, make sure you surround yourself with those that care about you. I mean, I'm like those that love you, that will guide you no matter what. Um, and whatever you're going through, you know, it, it, I mean, like you say, if it wasn't for his dog and his faith, you know, he probably would have, you know, lost his mind. But, oh, I have to be careful what, what I say. <laughs> he probably would have been in the psych ward. So, and if you guys know what a psych ward is, you know, it's not a place to be. Mostly when you're going through some kind of um, struggle and, you know, sometimes it's not beneficial. So, you know, always have a support uh, that's there to, to got, you know, catch you, um, to give you, um, so, you know, give you the energy, the, the, the spiritual need that you deserve when you're in those kind of situations. And um, this is coming from me. Uh, I've been through my own um, struggles not only uh you know the mind but the spirit but um all i can tell you support matters those that care for you those that really want to see you win and those that really want to see you do better will help in anything you do so uh shout out to oliver anthony uh for another amazing song you know uh i i know a lot of people or try to make it about you know politics and everything else but i believe you know it's relatable because everybody's struggling and mostly when you know where we are in today's society where there's social media there's you know a lot of misinformation and no and there's a division between you know our people and the people of the world you know whenever there's a a division nothing can come out of, out of it one thing I do want to emphasize is, you know, we're living in a, one of the country in the world, <sighs> you know, where you're able to express yourself not only through, you know, your freedom of speech, bare arms, and then on top of that, on top of that, the freedom of religion to practice your belief no matter what it is. So I think that's the most important one. Out of you know, out of all the freedom is the freedom to uh, to practice your belief and your faith. You know, at the end of the day, you know, we do have a, a time limit, uh, or you know, we we do expire. So at the end of the day, you know, I think out of all that, the freedom of faith, freedom of religion is the most important, and you got to. So, but you got to have number one, I believe freedom of speech so if i'm wrong i do apologize <laughs> but without further ado i uh, shout out to my subscribers supporters donors thank you without you guys this channel wouldn't be where, where it's at make sure you like comment subscribe uh press the <laughs> make sure you press the bell notification when i upload reload and download and without further ado i'm your host stay humble and like me till next time we out